Hi, I'm Cole Judkins. And I'm Melody Armanderas. And you're watching the 8th episode of the Greyhound Express Student News. As this is Lily, or Melody's senior year, this is her first and most likely last appearance on the show. So be sure to enjoy her while she's here. Speaking of last days, there's only 10 days left in the countdown to graduation. And if you're not a senior, you've got 15 more to go. That sucks. We have a ton of events coming up that we're all looking forward to. On to Natalie for those. Hi, I'm Natalie. Oh my gosh, I'm Natalie. There can't be two Natalies. Why not? You're right. Anyways, what's first on the list? Well, this Thursday, the Music and Arts program are holding their Night of the Arts at 7 p.m. at the high school. Sounds exciting. You know what else is exciting? Senior week. What's senior week? Senior week is a dress up week for all students here at the Grandview High School to celebrate the seniors last weeks. Here's a list of the dress up days. While there's no school on Monday, the rest of the week is filled with fun themes. Tuesday is dress as your younger self. Wednesday is soccer mom versus barbecue dad. Thursday is dress to impress by wearing your favorite outfit. And Friday is spirit day, so be sure to wear your best greyhound gear. That's going to be lit. And that's just a small part of the events planned for the upcoming week. We also have Memorial Day activities, including Flags In happening this Saturday at 8 a.m., where we will meet at the Grandview Cemetery to place flags on the graves of Grandview's veterans. Following that, there will be a Memorial Day ceremony held in the same location at 11 a.m. Remember that the U.S. flag is flown at half staff from sunrise to noon on Memorial Day. Flags Out will occur at 6 p.m., where we will help retrieve, inspect, and store the flags for next year. Community service hours will be awarded to those who come out to help. Well, those are your upcoming events for this week. Now back to Colin Malati for sports. Thanks, Natalie. Natalie. <laughs> and congratulations to the following athletes that qualified for the WIA state event later this week. Travis Hofford for golf, Jasmine Torres for golf as an alternate, Levi Dorsett, a regional champion for high jump, and Noe Medina for the 400 meter. Thank you for watching the eighth episode of the Greyhound Express Student News. If you have anything that would like to be broadcasted in the future, please send an email to Andres, Lily, or Cole at grandviewgreyhounds.com. Until next time, I'm Cole Judkins. And I'm Lily Cassinger, signing off.